Let's discover the meticulous process of building a cruise ship, starting with the massive engine block. It is a liquefied natural gas engine with up to 25,000 horsepower, equivalent to 25,000 horses, that not only delivers immense power but also reduces CO2 emissions by 20 to 25 percent compared to traditional diesel. The ship's bottom is assembled like giant Lego pieces, housing mainly technical compartments and operational support spaces. In this area, two liquefied natural gas tanks are also installed, with a total capacity of about 8,000 cubic meters, enough to supply long voyages. Once the first third of the hull is completed, this colossal structure is moved into the dry dock, water is pumped out, and it is towed to a larger shipyard to continue assembly. There, the passenger decks are raised, from luxurious hotel cabins to restaurants, leisure areas, and all kinds of amenities. When one-third of the ship is assembled, the entire structure is again moved outside, and the central section of the hull is brought into the dock for further assembly. At this stage, more passenger decks are added, built from enormous blocks weighing hundreds to thousands of tons. Once this section is complete, it is firmly joined with the already finished stern. Next comes the bow, featuring large circular openings with propellers inside, known as bow thrusters, that allow the ship to maneuver when docking, turning, or moving sideways. At the very bottom lies the bulbous bow, which reduces drag, saves fuel, and improves stability. After the hull is completed, the entire exterior is coated with multiple protective layers of paint, and finally the massive structure is moved outside, ready for the next phase of construction.